hello loves welcome back to um archangel thursdays um we're gonna get started this is gonna be group one um and starting right from the get-go um from archangel gabriel we have um law of attraction for this week so it says keep your thoughts private oh i'm sorry positive i don't know whoever who needed to hear that one um and surround yourself with positive people and situations and you will attract more positivity into your life that's facts um archangel michael says be gentle with yourself okay um in the prayer goes archangel michael please guide me in treating myself with gentle nurturing love and everything i think speak and do help me to know that i deserve this compassion i release any feelings of guilt so that you may experience that so that i may experience um lasting inner peace okay and then we have home help and the prayer goes from Archangel Raphael. Dear, dear God and Archangel Raphael, thank you for giving me the courage to ask for and accept help from you, the angels and others in matters regarding fam my family and home. Okay, so I feel like for my group ones, you guys are a little bit stressed out. Not just personally, but I think your home environment, your home space is stressing you guys out this week. Um, whether that be some bills are due, whether that be... Um, some of the family dynamics and and relationships and arguments that can kind of rise um are kind of taking a little bit more of a focus this particular week um i feel like if what you've been envisioning is an uh, an escape or a um sense of relief or just feeling more at home and having more of that home sacred space pretty much energy especially if you're trying to move or make any types of moves right now um to any capacity i do feel like you need to take it a little easy okay stop trying to stress yourself out especially if you're trying to maintain a certain deadline um not everything can be kept to a deadline um not, not everything can be controlled and so sometimes you just gotta like breathe because you stressing out isn't going to solve anything. Um, and so make sure that you're not just connecting with those who support you this particular week, but you're also giving yourself the space to kind of be like, okay, well, this is what it is. Um, and try to relax, especially with any type of home dynamic stress. Um, try to see what you can do that would make your life a little bit easier. So if you need to wake up an hour earlier in the morning, um, plan for that at least that what you can control control what you can't control prey on it it's as simple as that but i do feel like if things have been a little bit chaotic in your home space and there has been weird energies just because of everything that's going on make sure that you are um still trying to connect with the lighter side to connect with the positivity to connect with your gratitude with your joy with your love um because those moments that you allow yourself to just release uh, it's going to give you that kind of, uh, it's almost like that that breath of fresh air that you needed and that you didn't know you needed within those moments. So be a little easy, relax, um, still move from a place of um, attracting what you want. And I do feel like you guys, if you guys are feeling in a low vibe, start playing affirmations every day for the, the whole week. Just play affirmations. Anytime somebody's trying to start an argument or say something, you know what, just start playing affirmations throughout the house. Affirm your space put the the energy of what you want to come in into your space and then watch it come in okay but definitely pray on it i feel like you guys just need to pray okay now my group th uh two we have birth coming from archangel uh, gabriel new life such as a baby an idea happy news or an exciting project blossoms within um and around you okay then we have from archangel michael this situation is already resolved okay and the prayer goes i give any worries cares and concerns to you in exchange for true peace in all ways thank you for resolving this and then says please give details about the situation in a divinely perfect way okay and then we're getting hydration okay Woo! um and from archangel Raphael, dear archangel Raphael, thank you for motivating and guiding me to drink more water so that my health energy and appetite stays optimal levels throughout each day okay so this is actually very powerful because when it when we're talking about water when we're talking about nourishment when we're talking about our you know who we are especially within the physical realm because we are earth beings we're we, all of these this body is an earth body okay um it's not an air body okay it's not a fire body it is an air i'm sorry earth 
body and it very much connects to the water because we are what percentage of water are we so we're an earth body that's full of water okay so i need y'all to maintain your hydration and and that has to do with everywhere water applies that includes your emotions are you emotionally hydrated okay are you in a good place emotionally are you thirsty are you like do you feel um a little bit like you, you're just lacking stuff do you feel a little bit numb that's lacking of emotion if you've been in a flux emotionally you need to cleanse those emotions so hydrate yourself in the best way that you need to apply it whether that be i need to do a spiritual bath because on a spiritual level my body i just feel so like tired or i feel so um kind of everywhere like i feel chaotic go back to that hydration go back to that water connect to that water element um and make sure that you are staying hydrated you guys know i use the example of your life is a garden your manifestations are in a garden all the time if you don't water your garden you're not going to see anything grow so i need you guys to maintain this hydration um within your lives especially when as it connects to water now you're getting two things here you're getting birth and you're getting the situations already resolved i feel like for some of you guys if you have been kind of trying to prey on an opening of any type of capacity when it comes to wanting like uh, something new to come in a new idea to come in a new uh, a, a business idea to come in or maybe a new job to come in you already got the download a while back you just need to apply yourself you need to stop looking for an exit or trying to look for another way around it and approach what you need to do um head on because i feel like you guys already know what you need to do you just you haven't done it yet so i need you guys to kind of understand and move forward knowing that what you've been praying for is already in the moment for you and then i also need you guys to understand that if you have been getting downloads especially if you've been praying for that opening listen to and analyze the 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 ideas that you've had the thoughts that you had your dreams that you've had analyze everything as if it was the map that you need to progress forward okay now for my group threes you're getting vulnerability from archangel gabriel listen to your vulnerable feelings as they contain wisdom and inspiration and then pray for strength to focus on your priorities no matter what okay um, then you're getting innocence from Archangel Michael um, and the prayer goes, Dear God and, uh, and God and angels, thank you for helping me see that all of your qualities of pure love and light are reflected within me and all others. Help me embrace my God-given innocence so that I can, may be at peace, okay? Lots of sensitivity, okay? We're already off the bat. And then I'm getting sobriety from Archangel Raphael. Dear God and Archangel Raphael, thank you for adjusting my cravings in healthful direction so that I only desire life-affirming food and beverages. Okay, so I feel like there is definitely some childish, inner childish energies and vibes for my group threes for this particular week. I think you guys need to allow yourself to be a little bit more sensitive. I feel like there's this heavy like water energy coming from my group threes, whether that be Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, um, or whether you literally need to connect with the water element itself. But I do feel like there's an innocence here. I feel like you're at a point where it can either go left or right. You're at a point where um, this particular week, you can either heal from this and blossom or you can literally get too much sun and with like just kind of die dry out and die like i feel like you guys are stuck in this very sensitive state where you have to be gentle you have to slow down and be a little bit more gentle and that includes um sobering up of some bad habits that you kind of have been partaking in for quite some time if you have been kind of addicted to any type of you know substances um you guys need to clean yourselves out from it because you do especially if you do decide to do like a cleanse you will feel a little bit um tempted um but do what is necessary for you at the end of the day you need to allow yourself to maintain your sensitivity it's something that helps spiritually all of the time um so maintain your sensitivity in what, whatever way that looks like to you and it's okay to be vulnerable there's nothing wrong with it nobody's it is what it is but know how to disconnect know how to go into that virgo hermit mode pull back allow yourself to be through your your vulnerability and at the same time try to block out any of those temptations that try to come in okay so that is this week's archangel thursdays i will see you guys in the next one um have a beautiful day